doing it. Whatever is it? Is it an ordinary worm? It's climbing. What is it? How's it getting here? Whatever is it? Where does he think he's going? I have to put him outside somewhere and under a little stone or something in the garden. The front garden. Poor little thing. Oh, it's a miserable old day, weather-wise. You see how the plants are doing? <coughs> After being decimated by slugs last week. Well, not even a week ago yet, but um, some more in bloom now. The other one's dying off, so I don't know if these are going to recover, these little ones, but they're doing okay. These little flowers close up at night, look. Doesn't oh, she look good now? And an outfit for her, puppy play garbage. That looks smart now. I think I'm going to call her Phoebe. This is Puppy Play Barbie, but I think I'm going to name her Phoebe. I don't know why, the name just came to me. She does look smart now. I like finding outfits. I like rescuing a doll and finding a suitable outfit for her. I think she looks very nice in this. This belonged to um, Breeze originally, I think. Or was it Andrea? No, Breeze, but because and she's a petite, but it fits this one just fine. She looks very smart. I'm going to put the light on. I can see me. It's, I don't know, it's, it might be too dark. Let me see what if I'm, I've got the new dolly. I think, yeah, we look washed out, don't we? I've got some nail polishes to do swatches off and I don't want it too dark in here. It's my Sainsbury's haul from Saturday night. <coughs> oh, I haven't released her yet from the box. Barbie with a puppy. Oh. I was going to have Amelia here to help me today. Uh, is it Amelia? No, she's not Amelia. I'm getting myself all confused. This, this is Ami Amelia. Amelia, not Amelia, Amelia. No, this is Marielle. This is Marielle, and she's going to help me today. Let's get my hair out of the way. Oh, gosh. I wanted to tie my hair up, and I've forgotten. Um, this is Phoebe. All right, she's puppy play Barbie, but... I think I've, um... I'm not keen on the, the um, articulations. I think that uh, still, but at least you can move her legs like that if you want to. And uh, she looks pretty good, arm back. She looks good. I'm giving this one a necklace. I've got to find a skirt for her. I haven't named this one yet. Oh. Some of the dolls, well, they've got this greasy, not greasy, but sticky hair problem with the glue. When you put them together, you have to make sure none of them are touching any of the other Barbies, touching any of their clothes, anywhere near the other dolls, because I'm just going to make horrible marks on. This one's got a slight glue head problem, but it's not that bad. It's a bit, it's a bit hard, but it's not that bad. Anyhow, I can't 
got some here slides from Sainsbury's in the two section. A pretty hair band. Headband. A Thomas magazine because it's got Toby and a milk truck. Three. Oh, I've got one more for Christmas. Right. The Boots Christmas catalogue. Another baby lips, one of those because I was running out of that one. Halloween is still, you know, I mean, Morrison still have not got their Halloween um, things in the shop yet. I did get, this is It's a Boy, but when I was in there last week and I bought yet another roof terrace thinking I was buying that, the roof terrace was marked up as It's a Boy on the back, so I looked at it. And I thought, well, I won't get the one in front. It looks like it's been used as a tester. So I stuck it right at the back. I mean, I stuck it behind the one. And I mean, I stuck it behind and got the one that was at the back behind it. The same colour as the one that I'd looked at called It's a Boy. But of course, that one was marked up correctly. Because when I got it home, I saw it was a, a roof terrace, which I've already got downstairs. I don't explain myself very well. So I've got two roof terraces. And this is It's a Boy. I think I may do a comparison to see how this compares to Uptown Girl by Maybelline. This is a nice colour though. Well, I've got so many blues in that colour. And um, I didn't think the colour showed nail polishes last too well. Not very well. They're alright, but um, I like the look of the jelly one. But it doesn't last at all well. This colour changing nail polish, I'm not quite sure what they mean by colour changing. I got these, They're the glitter tops. This is a Disney princess as you can see from Boots, buy three, get one free. Buy three and get one free. Yeah, this is all about the nails. So, um, hang on, I'll get myself organised and I'll be back to do the testing. I forgot to mention, of course, these are the Happy Jackson set. Remember, I did uh, one of uh, I bought a Happy Jackson set a couple of years ago in my first ever haul video. Well, it was just a straight run I didn't before I didn't do, I didn't do any editing then I didn't know anything about editing it was just a straight run and um, I featured these so it wasn't a very good video obviously what's this this is can't stop the doodle so that's probably a oh, I don't know what this is but if it's a pet it's one of those pens to get rid of is it or to draw on it because there's a that's the delete one on top unless that's nail polish no this is a delete pen I'm sure yeah it is so this one I suppose just meant to draw on it or something I don't know oh, maybe you dip that in add some instant awesome to your fingers and toes with our fantastic nail products and doodle pen made a mistake no worries our handy corrector will sort that slip right out okay nails let's party nail polish set This one's called Big Love, Ooh Baby, Happy Days, and Whoop Whoop. Whoop Whoop, is that from the TARDIS? Oh, that's a different sound, isn't it? Okay, so let's do... Well, they've got that quite nice feel on the top. So, as I said, it's... um. Yeah, you get good colouring. I want so these top... Oh, yeah, they lift off, which makes it a bit easier to apply. 
got white screen again. Oh, we've come back now momentarily. So, um, so that one was Big Love. A nice, it's a nice coral. And this one is Ooh Baby. You can you can do it as you noticed just now. You can still take them off and unscrew them, even with the big top outer tops on but I guess it's easier to do with them off that look both of these look like they're going to be one coat size. this is a pretty color happy days it's a lovely color right oh yeah one coat definitely definitely fo one coat look at that definitely one coat Lovely. I don't know if this one will be because I can see this is a glitter. So I don't know if this is going to be a one coat. No, I don't think so. No, it, it's a clear base. I think I've dropped it. It's a clear base and it's got black and white glitter, that which aren't glitter, they're just flecks. When I looked first, I thought it was a black base with white glitter flecks, which is not actually glitter. It's um, so it's quite nice though. So it might look okay over the colour, but I, I don't tend to wear those things. They're a nightmare to get off. Unless I suppose I use one of. The, I could always put it over one of those colour show jelly ones that I was talking about. Have these got names? Transform your nails with this collection of colourful nail polishes. Which princess will you be today? Shake nail polish by one coat. Mint green, pink, purple, yellow and blue. Yeah, I've bought these before from Tesco in different packaging, but they were different colours. They were different shades. There's the pink one. No, na no na name, it's just on. Um... Right, let's... At least the tops, and where they're glittery, at least they're nice and um, you've got like a firm grip on them to undo. If, the to if they're a bit stiff, they undo easily. So that's a... I don't know if these are going to dry matte because they're neons and lots of neon, most neons in fact, dry completely matte. Though <clears throat> I've got some that don't, some little known brands I've got, I can't remember the names of them, but they do not dry matte, they dry glossy. So there we go, that's the purple one, that's going to be a one coat, one coat under. There's the blue. These are pretty colours, you know. We've got white screen again, so I'm hoping you can see me. This one, I believe, is going to take more than one coat to cover. I think it will. I do think it will. That's a pretty colour. This is the mint green or turquoise. I hope this is going to be a... I think this is going to be a one coat one. I've got completely white screen, so I'm hoping you can see this. So disheartening. And there's the, I <coughs> hope this lovely yellow one's going to be a... No, this is a sheer one, I can see that. Why have they made it so sheer? don't need to. I can see that's going to be about four coats to get this one. You'll have to put that over a white base. Probably because they're meant to be neons, I expect. Is that all? So I took my frozen bag with me. Yeah, there's nothing else. That's it. So, Marielle. Bye bye. Here's the puppy Chase, Barbie. I think I'll take these leggings off her because they're, they're yeah, they're. I prefer her without the leggings. I think. Yeah. We'll take these leggings off.
Because she'd look better without those. And they're easier to hold the dolls without things on their legs anyway. She looks nicer without the leggings. She doesn't need the leggings on. Let's take her shoes off and take these things off. And they might be useful for another Barbie that hasn't got any clothes, as I've got some Barbies with no clothes. At least her shoes go on. Aren't on with those last stick. The puppy's attached to her. And she was in the sale, you see, in Sainsbury's. I've been seeing her there for weeks and didn't want her. And I thought, no, I'm going to get her now. She was the last one. And she was in a different section. So there, there she is. She Barbie. Oh, at least the good thing is, the good thing is, you can use this puppy play thing in her back to hold on to her if you want to. You might want to um, look at Marielle while I read this. These playful nail polishes change colour based on your body temperature, your mood, the heat of your cup of coffee, or even while you're holding an ice-cold lemonade. I never hold ice-cold lemonades. I don't drink lemonade. Let's have a look. The one I had free with the magazine that I used that time wasn't very, um, it was almost see-through. So I'd have to wear these to um, see what colours they're going to probably be just different shades of their their own colour. So there's the pink. And let's try the blue. Nice colour, that's pretty. I wonder what... I'll have to put it in the cold water and see. Mind you, as soon as August... End, as soon as August was the end of August... The weather turned cold and it was like winter. I just can't stand the cold weather. I've got seasonal affective disorder already. I had it at the end of August and it was really cold today. My throat's scratchy. Well, of course, we are the 2nd of October now. But as I've recounted before, I remember going on the beach one Halloween and it was like a, it was a heat wave. It was lovely and it stayed like that until the 4th of November, about three or four years ago now. There's three different lots of little plant in bloom here, look. Different sorts. I think magenta is a good name for this girl. Magenta. So I've got this one. Tasty toasted spout flakes muesli. It's only Waitrose that sell this one, the spout. This one I got from Sainsbury's, the luscious berry and cherry muesli. They're, they are nice, these mueslis. I can highly recommend them. I've just used the last of my Assam tea. There, there's the infuser. There it, goes in, there it goes into the cup. And I like what it says inside. Can you see that? Time for tea, it says. Time for tea. Now that it's empty. Right, dollies are being washed. Put the light on the scene here. Dark. It's a bit better. Oh, it's at my friend's house. There. Dollies being washed. life down here so <laughs> this is a Delancey doll as you can see and that's a Madison doll with her earrings snapped off why do people do that I'm having a problem naming the girls this one, I don't think she wants to be called Phoebe. I wanted to name her Phoebe, but I don't think she wants to be called Phoebe. Maybe I'll call this one Phoebe. So maybe I'll call this one Sheba, or Ludmilla, or Svetlana, or Sophia. I don't know, but she doesn't seem to want to be called Phoebe. But then I was going to call this one. I was going to call this one Sophia. 
with an F. Oh dear, this is a problem. So yeah, I had it in my mind this one was going to be Phoebe. But it's niggling at the back of my mind. She's not Phoebe. She doesn't want to be. She doesn't look like a Phoebe. She doesn't want to be Phoebe. And maybe this one can be Phoebe. I don't know. But I can't think of a suitable name for this one. I've had it in my mind. She was Phoebe. I may stick with it. This is a dilemma of naming the, the dolls. You don't want them just... As I said before, I don't want them all called Barbie just because they're Barbies. I like the, my scene girls. I don't want all the... Chelsea's to be called Chelsea and all the different Nullies to be called Nully and um, I've already got a Madison doll so I know they call her Wesley as well but I might call one that and then I've got a Delancey one that I might just call Delancey and there's the, the Barbie one with the, and then the Kennedy one but I, I just it's a because I like to name them individually because they're each individual characters in their own right this is causing a problem now which is silly I know Marlena, perhaps? Marlena? Here's Rin. Here's Estelle. Frida. And Harmony. Discard. This Delancey doll, I think I'm going to call Bathsheba. Bathsheba? Bathsheba. I've dressed her, I didn't like the outfit she came in, it didn't suit her, it wasn't a nice scene outfit, so I found these things for her to wear, I think that's a no lee skirt, and maybe a no lee top, and no lee shoes, but they go with this Delancey doll, who I think I, yeah, I'm going to name Bathsheba, Bathsheba, I know the hair slide doesn't go with her outfit, but her hair's very thick, I like Kimberly's hair is, and um, I don't know if the shoes suit her skin colour, I don't know if they might do, but yeah, I think this looks nice on her, so this is Bathsheba. Oh, we've got white screen again, and I've, I've, I've been recently, after I fixed the computer, I knew it wouldn't last long I suppose, but after I fixed it, I've been used to seeing myself on screen again when I'm filming. Because then you can tell if you're in the right place. Oh, God, we've had This is Sainsbury's. Not Sainsbury's, sorry, get it right in a minute. Waitrose. I put the batteries in just now. Three AAA batteries it takes. It's flickering slightly. I'm got white screen so I don't know if you can if you can see it I hope you can oh I got this from Sainsbury's not Sainsbury's oh I'm all over see this is what it does to me I'll get I'm in a state enough at the best of times but, but when I can see this all going wrong Marks and Spencer Marks and Spencer Marks and Spencer's a lady was at the checkout behind me she said where, where did you get that from and I said whereabouts I, said, I was in the shopping part and I mean the food part and I still was around in the store so got this from Waitrose they never used to do this brand but they they are now and funnily enough Sainsbury started doing those not long ago and now they've stopped but Waitrose didn't have got these from Waitrose but the exciting thing where are they the exciting I need a light on don't I I think, I'm going to do that in a minute, I'll put the light on in a minute because things sometimes look slightly different with the light than they do without. Okay. Meet Rin. The new fashionistas, these are the four that they haven't got in the shops anywhere that I have found, so I got them from Amazon. Estelle. Estelle. I was going to call this one, I was not sure, I was going to call her Sophia, then I thought Frida, because um, I might call this one Sophia, not sure yet. And of course Phoebe is being awkward and doesn't want to be called Phoebe. So I think this girl can be Phoebe. Rather a sweet name and she looks sort of sweet, doesn't she? And this one I felt... I She's lost a shoe. I haven't named that yet. Anyhow, so yeah, that's probably Frida. And here's Harmony, always the cactus girl. Always knew she was going to be Harmony, but I don't expect... I don't expect you can see her probably, because 
I hope she shows up more. I shall take, I'm not going to do it now, I haven't got time, but I shall take them all out and it takes a while to unbox them, getting all these little bits and then having to take those nasty little things out of their hair with my pliers. And, um, oh my two. so, so, yeah, I'm hoping they show up, they're just complete white screen. Something you haven't got.